Hi guys, it's me on the Rafe, and today I'm going to help you memorize some words. I know it's pretty hard, but I'm going to memorize the even harder ones. So you're going from the first level to the 100 level. So the most hardest flats are the identical ones. It takes hours and hours to do it, or even days or months or years. But I can help you if you go with me on my road trip. And before we start, make sure you hit that subscribe button and like this video. I do remember this book of flat that reviewed this, so go check it out, really cool. Let's begin. Guys, we need to put the camera right here, so we need to buy. Look at these amazing stitches! Aren't they identical? Now it's magic time! I will do coloring and show them, you the minor differences and the meaning of the flat. Let's start with Bahrain and Tatar. Bahrain flat is very similar to its neighboring country, Tatar. Bahrain flat consists of white band separated from the red areas by five triangles which symbolize the five pillars of Islam. While Tatar flat has maroon color with nine points which is a symbol of its inclusion as the nine member of the Persian Gulf of the Rhythm South Emirates. White color represents peace whereas Maroon color symbolizes blood shed during the several wars, particularly those in the second half of the 19th century. Whoa, that's so cool. Now let me show you, and you, at least you can see the rest of the part. Here's the result. Let's go ahead. Now I'm sure you know the differences. Senegal and Cameroon now. Oh my, they look exactly the same, isn't it? Let's start them. The first stripe of Senegal and Cameroon is green. Senegal's green color symbolizes hope, whereas Cameroon's green color is for the forest in the southern part of Cameroon. The red stripe in Senegal represents life, sacrifice, and the willingness of the people to fight against underdevelopment, while five branches of the star represent the opening of Senegal to the five continents. The yellow stripe represents well. The Cameroon flat pattern reflects the French green color. Its red color is for unity, and the star is referred to as the Star of Unity. The yellow stands for the sun, and also the savannas in the northern part of the country. Hey, wait, did you know Molly and Dwina had the same dimensions and same stripes with little bright shades? But they, yes, they do not have stars. Wow, they look super cool. Let's see the similar flags of Indonesia, Poland, Monaco, and Singapore. In case of Indonesia and Poland, just reverse the color, whereas Monaco flag is exactly the same as Indonesia, but has different dimensions. Singapore has additional five stars that ideals of democracy, peace, progress, justice, and equality. Did you know in Indonesia their flag is called San Sapa Merapushi, meaning lofty by color red and white. Now it's turned to color Tuba and Puerto Rico. Wow, they look so identical. So let's see the color differences. The red color in the triangle identifies blood and the turret. The star was the new state that could be added to the United States. On the other side, Puerto Rico, blue color represents the sky and the blue coastal waters. Two best preview strikes represent the three departments in which Tuba was divided. That, that, at that time, the white represents light, 
for to read the red stripe represent the blood from the brave warriors. White for victory and peace and white star for the island of Puerto Rico. Wow, they were totally opposite, don't they, Doc? Let's move on to the Scandinavian flag. The reason all Scandinavian flags, like Norway, Iceland, Denmark, Finland, and Sweden, use the Nordic cross as their flag is due to the countries in the region having very similar history and are closely related. These flags have a cross symbol in a rectangular field. All independent Nordic countries have adopted such flags in the modern period. No one Iceland are tricolor Nordic flags, whereas Denmark, Finland, and Sweden are bicolor, means two color. Have you ever visited to the Nordic states? I've heard that among Scandinavian countries, Denmark has the most beautiful beaches, most idolized cities, harbors, interesting modern and world famous classic design. Evident buildings by famous architects, wondrous history, and the absolute best capital. Wow, I want to visit there since they also have the best lollipop in the world. I mean, popsicle. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's take a closer look. Whoa, identical flats coming your way. Costa Rica and Thailand are also similar. There are two differences. Polar are inverse and Costa Rica has an additional the thought of arm depicts the isthmus between the Pacific Ocean and the Arabian Sea. I with three volcanoes and seven stars stand for the seven provinces of Costa Rica. Its dark blue represents the sky, idealism, opportunity and perseverance. White for peace, wisdom, and happiness, and red for the blood spilled by martyrs defending the country. Similarly, tall and flat, red stripes represent the blood spilled. White for purity and buddhism, and blue symbolizes the time monarchy. Whoa, this is so cool. Here comes Jordan, Palestine, and Sudan. Black, red, and green are the traditional pan Arab color, and many Arab nations use them in the flag, including Egypt, Syria, and Iran. In Jordan flag, a white star with seven points stands for the unity of the Arab people and refers to the seven verses of Surah Al Fatiha of Muslim book Al Quran. Yay! We are now landing on Austria and Latvia. They look similar, but they had different width. Latvia white strip is thinner than Austrian flag, while Latvian red color is symbolizes the readiness of the Latvian to let the blood from their hearts for freedom and the willingness to defend their liberty. Now I am telling Turkey and Tunisia. Here you can see that they both have crescent and star. The only difference in Tunisia's crescent and star are in frame. The red color and dirty flag was adopted from the imperial stand color of the Ottoman. The crescent and star both flags are symbols of the religious belief of the Turkish people. In Tunisia, flag, white is for peace, and the star symbolizes that all Muslims are united in their beliefs and are united with the five pillars of Islam. Here it is with beautiful red color. Whoa, what a challenge, Romania. They are like copy pigs, and their strip color is also the same. Yes, they are. The Romanians? Flat blue color represents liberty, yellow for justice, and red for fraternity of the nation. Did do you know Romanian law designates the shades as stubal to blue, chrome yellow, and vermilion red? Wow, chat flat blue represents the sky and hope. The gold is the sun and desert, and the red signifies 
the blood shed over independence. One in the stomach in the flesh. Hmm, all red show blood shed and white for peace, isn't it? Let's talk about Colombia and Ecuador. The reason why Ecuador, Colombia, and also Venezuela have the same pride over on the flag because they were a part of a short lived state named Gran Colombia. After their successor state had declared independence, they changed to have the colors of yellow, red, and blue. Ecuador has an additional symbol of the torch of alarm, which is very interesting, if you ask me. It has the highest mountain in Ecuador, a river of golden sun surrounded by the zodiac astrological sign. Along with the tondo, which is a kind of vulture, stretches his wind to symbolize power, greatness, and the strength of Ecuador. In closer look, you can see Ecuador National Coat of Arms. Let's see, guys. Whoa, do you see it? It looks so cool, doesn't it? Let's dive to Japan, Bangladesh, and Palau. The past plan is prism and red. Color symbolizes sun as a prosperous future for Japan. The white background. The color stands for purity, honesty, and integrity of the people of Japan. In Bangladesh, flat green symbolizes the lost vegetation of Bangladeshi land, while red represents the blood from freedom fighters. The flat of flower represents the Pacific Island. The only difference is color. Here comes the long list of similar wooden flats. I'm sure when I color them, you can easily discriminate between them. Let me tell you an interesting fact. 53 independent nations belong to the British Commonwealth. Four of these countries had never had the Union Jack on the flag. The 44 have removed the Union Jack from the flag. They are Australia, New Zealand, Tuvalu, and Fiji. The Red Cross of St. George for the Kingdom of England, the White Psalter of St. Andrew for Scotland, and the Red Psalter for St. Patrick to represent Ireland. You can also see different kinds of stars and the symbols in this land, which made them a little bit different. Whoa, 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 this was so dark. I'm sure my video will help you understand these flags. And then we have a long chain of similar looking oil flags. Yemen, Syria, Iran, and Egypt. All these flags share similar red, white, and black horizontal stripes. Told as pan Arab colors. Syria's green star represents the Fatimid dynasty. Iraq's flag has additional red. Allah, what does? Means Allah is the greatest. Whereas, either our Egypt flag represents strength and power. Now you can take a closer look. Now, finally, our tour is ending on the steamer flags, which are Ireland, Ibitos, and Nina. Ireland and Ibis colors are reversed, but the strips are similar. In Ireland, the green pair of the flag shows the Roman Catholic, orange represents the minority, Protestants, and white signifies peace and hope for union between Protestants and Catholics. In Irish flag, orange is for Savannah grassland, white for the country river, and the green represents the coast of Fort. Wow, amazing, look at neither flag. It is similar to India's flag too. The colors of Nida symbolizes the Sahara Desert, purity, hope, and the region of South Nida, while sun, while the sun represents independence. This is all about the identity of flesh. Thank you for watching. And if you forget any of these flags, you don't watch it in. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos. Bye.